Hey, we've got QR codes. If you didn't know, um, you've had them now for about a week or so in the reviews and reputation section where you could actually connect it to a review site and print out a nice QR code that your customers can scan and leave your review. But did you know that today, like Reese, like in the last couple of minutes or so, uh, I got it. Um, but sometime in the last 24 hours, we now, if you go to sites on the left hand side where you have all your funnels and websites and everything now on the right hand side at the top, we have QR codes. So you can create a QR code or you can go in and edit a QR code, right? And you can say, do you want it to be a review QR code? Um, if you don't want it to be a review QR code, I believe up, oh, this is a review one. So I want to do a create a QR code, right? And I want it to go to a website, right? So if you have a webinar, right? And you want to send anybody who scans it to a webinar registration page, or maybe you just want to send them to a landing page for a lead magnet, or maybe you just want to send them a lead magnet. Now, you can link to any website you want. I'm going to call this um, Parentpreneur Webinar. This is something I'm doing for my daughter's school where I'm going to talk about um, how parents who have side hustles or businesses, how they can utilize AI to make their lives easier and be more efficient so that they can spend more time with their family. But that's a, I digress. That's not, that's not what you're here for. But what's cool about this is now we can set it up. And if I move this out of the way, come on now, you can go to next, put in the webinar registration link, which I believe I need to get mine. But for now, I'm just going to do, uh, I'll do my AI Branding Academy um, URL. I'm going to take this out. All right now I can click next. Now I can also make it in our colors. So let's say I want to do um, the dots color. Let's do those in my teal. Let's see if I can get that QR code real quick. Color history. You can choose and customize the design of your QR code. So if I do my teal, Hashtag and hit enter. There it is. I got a teal and I probably want to actually dots color that I thought that would be the dots here, but I guess not. So then the border color, if I do the same, whoops, I put the hashtag in there. I'm sure they'll fix that. That's just a minor thing. Okay, and then the marker center. So these are the markers. So I'm going to leave the markers black there for now. Shape and form, you can do different kinds of QR codes, how you want the border to look, what you want, you know, you can design it, make it look pretty. You can even stick a logo in the middle. And so like if you wanted to send people to your Facebook page, you could just pop the Facebook logo in here or LinkedIn or payment. You could use Stripe or MasterCard, right? I'm going to leave mine alone because it's for a webinar. I mean, I could do YouTube, but anyway, you, or you could actually upload a logo, right? So I'm going to leave it alone. And then the page background, I'm going to, you can make it an image. Um, I'm, I'm not going to do that. This is good for me. And you can then just download it. But the cool thing is when I save it, I've got it here. Now, if you have review QR codes from the reputation section uh, inside of your um, uh, store or I mean your your system, 
uh, it, it will add them here as well. So all of your QR codes will be located here, but you can create ones that don't have to be review generation QR codes. You can now create QR codes that go anywhere. And they've got a nifty analytics section. And the analytics section, of course, will tell you how many people um, scanned it and went to your site. So QR scans, right? And so you can do, um, you can, and you can select by scan. So scans by QR, how many scans did you get? Very, very cool. Hope you enjoy. Take care.